Facebook Live today. Um, we're going to be, I haven't really made a big announcement or anything, but we're talking about pushing back today. Uh, I think it's been a little bit of a challenge for everybody going into this August energy, leaving July, the August energy, which is about new beginnings. And a lot of times we have difficulties letting go of things that we recognize as our past. And so we try to hold on to the past as much as we can. And that's really what's in our subconscious mind is we're usually picking up information that we don't want to let go of because it's familiar to us. But guess what, guys? What feels comfortable or our comfort zones so many times is not what's good for us because it's comfortable. And when we're thinking that just because it worked for us in the past doesn't necessarily mean it's good for you now. It just means that it's recognizable, it's familiar, it's where you feel comfortable, but it's not usually what's best for you. And so in these last few days, I've had to push back and push back hard because there was a part of me that was that had realized that everything that I wanted is already here. And now I get to decide, am I going to jump? Right? Am I going to take that leap of faith and am I going to just jump into it and, and step into where it is that I'm supposed to be now? Or am I going to look at it and say, oh, you know what? I don't want to be first in line. Um, come on, everybody, just keep going ahead of me and I'm just going to wait here. Right? How many of you guys have done that in the past? Right? We all do that. We want to give other people opportunities when it's our turn. And so I'm telling you that today it is time to make it your turn and keep your turn. Don't give your number up like in um, Beetlejuice. Remember when the guy gives the number up to the other um, to the other guy just so that he can kind of cut in line. And so we're not letting anybody cut in line. We're not cutting in line. I want you to step into pushing back. When you feel like you're done, when you feel like you're tired, think of a race, right? The last the last minutes of the race are the hardest ones of all. That's when you're tired, you're exhausted, you feel overwhelmed. Why would you think that you're going to feel all refreshed and just going to glance and, and just have this opportunity and just jump into being the first in line or winning this race? Or No, when it gets hard is the time where you show character, you show discipline, you show how much you really want this. It's your turn to have it all. And so you're finally here. This is not the time to slip and fall and pretend like it's not your turn. This is the time to step it up, ramp it up, go full speed ahead, decide this is you, this is what you deserve, this is what you've been working on your whole life. Think about it. So many times it's because we're so close to that purpose. We're so close to that job. We're so close to that relationship. And what do we do? We give up. We step back. We stop pushing. And so today I am telling you, you have no excuse but to push back. Push as hard as you can. Make this your new whatever it is that you want. Make this your new purpose, your new mission, your new relationship, your new job, your new opportunity. Just make it what you want it to be because it's showing up and the universe is not going to make it easy for you. It's showing up with difficulties. It's showing up with, with a lot of interferences, we can call them, is showing up to see how much you really want this. This is the opportunity that you have to put your money where your mouth is. How much do you really want it? Oh yeah, you, you really think that you want it that much and you really think that it's your turn and you really think that you're up to this fight and you really think that you're ready to step into it and you really think that you're in this space of leaping into the unknown and you're going to say yes. Yes, I am, because it's my turn, and no one's cutting in front of me this time. You have been building up for all of this. I know who you are. We've done a lot of work together. I know that you guys are ready for this. You know why? Because it's showing up. And that's what August is all about. That's what this energy is all about. That's what all of these eclipses are all about. What are you eclipsing in your life? What are you ready to step into? Remember, we've talked about this before, and if you haven't been on, if you haven't heard this, I'm gonna say it again. We must be the vibration of that which we want to create in our life. If you want abundance, you've got to be in the, in, in the vibration of abundance. You've got to be that already before you step in and, and acquire it in your life. If you want that perfect relationship, you've got to be in the vibration of that perfect relationship. If you want more money and finances, you've got to be in that space, guys. And so I'm 
asking you to be nice to yourselves and don't give up this time. Push back. Pushing back is not a bad thing. Pushing back just tells God, the universe, your higher self, your indwelling God, however it is that you depict this powerful light source that you believe in, that you know is masterful and has always been with you every step of your, of your journey. I am just here to remind you that pushing back just means that you know that you deserve it and you're ready to accept it. And so I'm leaving you off tonight with this message. Open your heart and be ready to receive. As you're pushing back, you're pushing back with determination, perseverance, with love in your heart, with acceptance that it's already here and you're so excited because you know, you know that you can't back out of this one now. And so just push as hard as you can and step into what is already here for you. I love you all. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much, Yoyi, Daisy, Doris, Grace, Vanessa, Nieves, Tracy, Soli. Thank you so much for joining me and all you others that I know will listen to it on your own time. Again, thank you so much for being such an amazing soul and having such a wonderful consciousness to understand that it's your turn to be the best and the greatest that you can possibly be. Thank you again for tuning in and have a great day and great night.